Hey, I'd like to welcome y'all to my version of the 80 Vibe show. What a wonderful day y'all chose to engage with us. Cause we got a show for y'all. Yeah, show my boy J-O-N on the bass. Chi -chi. Cut on the drums. Clacks on the keys. Hey, hey, and I go by the name of Trans Lee. Woo. We just gonna vibe into it like that, cause that's what music is, it's a vibe. It can get you through your day, get you through your life. Dead ass. Hey, listen, this already a classic. You embarrassed already. The flow is breaking the levee. The motor is shaking the Chevy. Reality fucking you over. The op ain't taking a vacay. You gotta be all about your business and stop doing the hey, hey. Checks is balancing, uh. My label ain't gambling, uh. You gotta get off the block, you making it high. Jeez, my mama went up to heaven and saved me a sly. Please, maybe it's real, maybe it's not. But you gotta drop shit till you hot. You gotta fail your way to the top. It's a lesson whenever you flop, or it's a blessing whenever you lost. You gotta spend money to floss. You gotta spend money to win. Oh, I want some big money to lend, and I'ma go flip something again when I walk, like talk, like uh. Some money if my spirit ain't feeling it. I ain't going for it. CC get it maxed up. And it's showing, showing, telling everybody they ain't going where you going, going, uh. My consciousness been telling on me. You got none, I got hella on me. I was low and they was bailing on me, selling on me. Bitches with Mojave Desert on me. Couldn't see my vision, they went hellin' on me. Ain't the only one in church that got a seven on me. It's some saints and it's some sinners in the ceremony. Pain was candy, nothing was sweet, never Zanny, always tree. It's never you, it's always me. Trust that I gotta walk light, talk light, uh. Some money in my spirit ain't feeling it. I ain't going for it. CC getting maxed out. And it's showing, showing, telling everybody they ain't going where you going, going. My consciousness been telling on me. You got none, I got hella on me. I was low and they was bailing on me, selling on me. Bitches went Mojave Desert on me. Couldn't see my vision, they went hellin' on me. I ain't the only one in church that got a seven on me. It's some saints and it's some sinners in the ceremony. Paint was candy, nothing was sweet. Never Zanny, always tree. Never you, always me. Trust that I gotta walk like, talk like. Some money in my spirit ain't feeling it. I ain't going for it, CC getting maxed out. And it's showing, showing, telling everybody they ain't going where you going, okay. My consciousness been telling on me. You got none, I got hella on me. Slick got overzealous. The devil's getting jealous. The baddest of the bad with me. I got ambition, they can smell it. A couple, a couple people told me that this song was, you know, very, you know, churchy. And that's why I gotta take him to church. Take him to church. Okay, take him to church. Okay, okay, take him to church. One more, one more time when I walk light, talk light. Some money in my spirit ain't feeling it. I ain't going for it. CC get it maxed out. And it's showing, showing, telling everybody they ain't going where you going. Woo! Uh. Uh, 85, yeah, this one feel right, yeah, yeah, sometimes we get caught up in the rhyme, it happens every time, yeah, shout my brother Gray, thankful we're here to see another day, all right, all right, yeah, walk light, talk light, some money if my spirit ain't feeling it. I ain't going for it, CC get it maxed out. And it's showing, showing, telling everybody they ain't going where you're going, going. This performance right here is dedicated to my uncle, Uncle JD, who lost his life to COVID-19. It's a hell of a time right now, man. And you know, whenever people say, you know, whenever it's all over with, but you don't understand some people, once it's all over with, some people really lost real loved ones, man. So shout out to everybody that really lost somebody in this whole struggle, man. We all in this together. So, hey. Hey, yeah.
Welcome back to 80 Vibe, I'm Ray. If you've been doing a little bit more sipping than usual, it might be time for a water break. So we're gonna have some Fiji water, some orange slices for vitamin C, strawberries for a little bit of flavor, and then some mint sprig for freshness. We're staying nice and hydrated with our fresh infused water. Fun fact, 70% of the human brain is actually made from water, so this is really good for you. Stay tuned for more 80 Vibe. Yeah, this is the 80 Vibe, cause it's a vibe for those who can't go outside. Yeah, the 80 Vibe, because you can't go outside. The 80 vibe, because you can't go outside. My homie J-O-N just picked the bass up. That mean he bout to fuck your face up. This nigga groove like no other can do. You already know we bringing smooth shit to you in your house, cause you can't go out. Everybody at the motherfucking house right now. You know it's about to get real illa. About to bring my brother Carlos Miller. Because it ain't a nigga that's illa when it come to the killer shit that we spit on the microphone. My nigga was stuck at home, but he said, fuck it. He came outside like a drone to kick it in, to get it in, to bring a friend. We can't bring a friend, cause you know we COVID-19, social distancing. Okay, but it's okay. My nigga Carlos Miller, come and tell him what you got to say. Make some noise, my brother Carlos Miller in the building on the 80 vibe. I'm just gonna yeah. sit right here. Hey, that was real funky right there. You know it. I like how you was building that. You see it? When you did what you did when you was doing it. Well, keep it going then. Nigga, you amazing. Matter of fact, you magnificent. Let a nigga like me gon' kick some shit. Okay. One more time for the people who don't have nothing. For my niggas on the grind trying to get something. Let go. You seen what I do the way I came in that bitch with a kung fu move. I hit my groove. And I kept that shit smooth. You know I'm just doing what I always do. That's I grab the boobs and then the titties. Yep. And then compliment her, tell her that she pretty. Keep it going. I grab the boobs yep. and then the titties. Okay. And then compliment her, tell her that she pretty. That's what you do. And then take her out to eat because I'm so sweet. And then she a vegetarian. I gave her meat. Whoa. Whoa. Changing up the diet. She said she ain't like it. I said, bitch, try, try it. it. Okay. Oh, we in the room. Me. 85, we doing this for you. My nigga Carlos Miller came through with the blunt. He keep it real, my nigga don't ever stunt. You know it's going down on the 80 vibe. This is for all of my niggas who cannot go outside. And that's you, and you, and you, and you, and you, and your little man, cause school close too. Okay, I said, yes. Chico, P. Diddy gon' hear this. Hey. What you say? Chico. One more time. P. Diddy gotta hear this. He gotta hear this. I said, Chico. What you say? P. Diddy gotta hear this. You know we gotta hear this. I said, Chico. What you say? P. Diddy gotta hear this. You know we gotta hear this. You know we gotta hear this. Because you know he's stuck in the house. Even though he's a millionaire, he still can't go out. Everybody's trying to COVID-19 preparate. Because you already know you don't want on your face when you get the coughing up. Then, uh, 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 ah. Don't cough around me, you might die. Okay, we on the 80s vibes, and we keeping the vibes alive. I had this cutie. Okay. I want me to be her man, but I might not do it. She don't wash her hands. I said, oh. ugh, you know I'm trying to ride her. So I gave the bitch some hand sanitizer. Okay. Hit it from the back, let the balls hit the clitoris. Let me stop, because right now I'm getting ignorant. Nobody want to hear that shit, because it's nasty. Nigga, puff, puff, pass I had a me. little girl and we might fight. I had to hit her coochie lips with some Lysol wipes. I'm what? like, damn, what you been doing? You been in the house, so how the fuck you been screwing? Many niggas, cause that's what it smell like. I had to leave the house, but I couldn't at night, cause we on quarantine. God damn. I'd rather be stuck at the house with a cutie. But I'm so damn tired of eating coochie. Okay. Damn. When is it over? When is it over? We'll never know. We'll never know. We'll never know. They said it's gonna be over April 30th, but I don't think so. 
tangled up. I'm in the court. I've been up at the house all day being bored. Uh -huh. So then I came outside, but they said, don't go. Okay. I said, hell no, I got to go record the show because you already know my people want to hear. And just like I said, everybody going to feel it. We up in this bitch and we having a whole damn jam. I'm about to roll up some more of them green eggs and ham. Pam. What the fuck is Pam? She ain't called me back. She said we was going to kick it just like that, but I ain't heard nothing from her because she's smart and I ain't talked to her since she left. Martin. Hey, you know time, it is ample. Hey, Lowe's, how you feel about Easter being canceled? Hey, it ain't nobody gonna be able to wear the Easter outfit to go show shit. They now, I'ma go. say this, but you might not want to hear it. You saying this year is over with, period. Yep, you can't go outside. You can't go outside. Hey, I say the lockdown just begun. You won't see outdoors to 2021, if you ask me. If you ask me. They said stay in the house, don't go outside. Hey, I don't go outside. What they say? Said, stay, stay in, in the, the house, house, don't go outside. outside. What they say? Go outside. Hey, you got to stay, stay in the, the house, house and don't go outside. outside. What? And don't go outside. outside. What? You, you got, got to stay, stay in the house and don't go outside. Because if you go and outside. Don't go outside. Uh, if you go outside, they say that you might die. They say if you go outside, they say your eyes gonna cry. They say you go outside, they say you gonna get sick. They say you go outside and you ain't gonna find shit. You ain't gonna find no toilet tissue, no lights all white. You ain't gonna find no bitches to make your wife. You ain't gonna find nowhere to sit down and eat. You ain't gonna find nowhere to take a big booty free. I'm at the crib. You know what I need, nigga? Got so bored, start watching DVDs. Damn. With the menu. Don't even know what my friends do. Hey, Lowe's, you know I never, ever been a hater, but where the fuck did you find a DVD player? Selling them rocks. You know I played that shit on my fucking Xbox. On your Xbox. Yes, you did. Because they played DVDs and that's ill. I said we got claps on the keys. We got cut suit drumming like a D. We got J-O-N on the bass. You can tell just look at his face. That shit he playing is real, real groovy. He look like he in a war movie. Let's when go. everybody see this, I hope they check it. And for the people who be walking around their house butt naked, when they see this, I hope they check it. It is for everybody walking around the house butt naked, 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 a butt nigga, gotta walk, walk around the house. Hey, a butt nigga, a butt nigga, one more time. A butt nigga, but a butt nigga, butt nigga, butt nigga, a butt nigga, walk around butt nigga, a butt nigga. I write five, four, three, two, one, and stop. Let's go. This is the '85. That is Carlos Miller. Ain't a nigga Ella. I am Chico Bean. If you look at me, you know it's clean. We got my cousin, cousin. For real? Yeah, this my dog, man. Trans Lee in the You already know. Words, What's man? up, man? What's happening, man? How you doing, G? Hey, man, good, man, good, good. We appreciate you coming through for having me, man. Oh, yeah, appreciate y'all having me, man. Blessed to be here. For sure. My first question <laughs> is, how'd you get your name? That's a unique name, Trans Lee. Where did that come from? Man, that's actually, a lot of people don't know. That's my real name. Like, Word. Yeah, I'm, and I'm the third, too, so my... My great grand, I mean, my granddaddy. Well, my great granddaddy named my granddaddy. Now, where they got it from, by the time I asked my granddaddy, he was kind of too old. I don't think he really knew. But um, I actually gave it his own meaning. And I, uh, transcends all boundaries. That's what's and, up. And that's just a meaning I had to give it because I couldn't get it from him. So, yeah. What is this? That's dope. No, sale, that's dope. Hey, you were always repping the dirty south. Dude. Yeah, man. That's the only place I ever knew. Tell them where you're from, bro. Man, born in Albany, uh, but raised in Huntsville. Um, like, all my family is still in Albany, so my heart is in Albany, but I was raised in Alabama, so I repped them. Um, and then I moved to Atlanta in like 2010, uh, interning with Collie Park. Me and my manager, Chris, we used to just come down here and come to like uh, music conferences and stuff like that. And like, we used to just hang around trying to meet who we could meet because Atlanta was real cliquish back then. So we right. used to just try to meet who we can meet because we just had a dream or whatever. So we we um one day met Collie Park, Mr. Collie Park, DJ Smurf for, you know, um and I love how he got two names and it's like two different two different yeah yeah, yeah right right and and it's like and his real name Michael Crooms like that's a whole nother 
person that I know him exactly. as on the family side. Yeah, so he, but but yeah, he, we actually end up meeting him. Like we 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 like saw him, and we like basically start following him around until he started talking to us, and we and we start chopping up with him. And he was like, "Yeah, I'm come intern." So we just moved from Alabama, came to Atlanta, and um, and started working. Like you know, I had to get jobs and shit, but you know, it, it was a cool Made thing. Made it happen though. Honestly. Yeah, like you know, it was working with VIC, passing CDs out. You know what I mean? That was yeah. So <laughs> we was working silly. that. Yeah, no, silly. we weren't even working that. We was working bow. They were all like, "Good, uh, what are we saying bow, bow." Okay, oh, bet. Bow, I remember bet. that joint. <laughs> So what got you into the music? Like, what got you to, to, to even want to pursue that type of dream? Where did it start for you at? Well, when I first started getting in the studio, it was after my mother passed when I was 16. Um, that was a that was a time when me and my my best friend, Gerard Miller, um, though he go by Lil Miller, okay. rapping. And uh, me and him, we started. He got to be a cool nigga. Man, yeah, cool as shit, dog. Yeah, he, 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 he's super cool. And, um, right. <laughs> and um, we started going to the studio and for him, whatever he was getting out of it, I don't know. But for me, it was like relieving just whatever I had going on. In it. Yeah, it was very therapeutic. And I was just talk about whatever I had going on in my life. And and that's really how I started rapping. I didn't start rapping because I felt like I wanted to be cool or anything like that. Like yeah. it's just that's, that was just a coping mechanism for me. And after that, it just grew into something because I love with it. Yeah, and then when I met my manager, Chris, it was like he had he had a studio, and it was like we just. Start working and we never stopped working from then. And so when we met Collie Park, we, we just moved down here, whatever, start interning. So like the song that you performed already for us, and you got another one coming up for us, mm-hmm. like, but what at this point now that you're into it and you you didn't got your, you know, feet grounded, like what motivates the content or the type of music that you make? Man, like I said, really it's just whatever's going on in my life. Like if I ain't seen it or felt it or been around it, then I just don't talk about it. You you know, like when you, like it's not a hard thing to come up with raps like when it, when it's flowing it flows easily because like one one of my favorite Jay-Z lines is he said like he don't he don't write he just recall you know what I mean and, and I feel like that's what I do for the most part you know what I mean like you know we have our fun records but for the, for the most part my music is just grounded in realness and I think when certain people hear it they can connect to it and if you don't connect to it then that's just what you got going on but as for my listeners I know that the people that have been rocking with me, I know that they really connect and they, they see some part of my music like, oh, I, I go through that same thing too. Exactly. You know so, what I mean? So for the people who don't know who you are, they're seeing you for the first time. If it was a song that you would direct them to to give them an idea of what you bring and who you are, what would that song be? Probably Lost in the Sauce. Lost in the Sauce. Lost in the Sauce. <laughs> that's the song that actually, I think, is the, I think that's the song that got tip attention. Okay. Um, I was just gonna ask you about yeah. that, man. You did link up with Grand Husband. Yeah, yeah. So um I would probably say that song. Um Owe Me to the Game on my last project would be a song that it's uh, always dope to see you do your thing, man. You never know where you're gonna come from or what you're gonna hit on with. I love the surprise element of your music. Yeah. And keep doing your motherfucking thing. And keep rocking this shit. And, and you ain't done, done. you great. You ain't done. Done. something else yeah, too, man. man. So, you know what I mean? What's yeah. the next one you great perform for? Man, catch this wave. It's actually featuring Tip. Featuring oh, that's Tip dope. Word. Yeah, yeah, it's called Catch This Wave. Um, and I ain't even get to shout out everybody on the team, man. Yes, you, you do. You got DNC, that. DNC for sure, man. Shout out Chris Hunter, Derek Jackson, uh, Javon, um, my, my producer, Halftime Slim, Todd Marshall. Halftime Slim actually produced both these records I'm performing today and yeah. Bring Back Fubu. Okay. Uh, Where can they follow you at, though? Uh, Trans Lee. At Trans Lee. At Trans Lee. Yeah. Yeah, man, we're um, trying to open up our, our platform. Hey, man, follow bring the boy, people man. who we that's know on, are dope. You know? That's on all platforms. Translate. So, so glad y'all still here with us today. I need everybody to put a hand in the sky if you love somebody. Hand in the sky if you love somebody. That should be everybody in the building. For sure. You gotta understand it's a vibe right now. 85. Listen, listen. I took them chains up around my feet. Put them back around my neck. Working till I can't sleep no more. But that money just worth my stress. I bet you knew that, though. Hey, I bet you knew that. Can't catch this wave, can't catch this wave, not with your do-rag on. One of these days I'm gonna be 
Way far away, so low key. And I don't give a damn what your mouth say. You fuck niggas still don't know me. And I don't wanna hear about your bread till you're rich enough to not get shot by the police. Can't catch this wave, can't catch this wave. Hey, we taking them shackles off. I want the gold rings like my uncle in Saginaw. My bandwagon too heavy, I'm keeping it steady by taking that wagon off. Freeing myself from all the constraint. Social media and weed, alcohol, sex addiction, and greed is looking like a new lazy to me. I'm blessed up, been running my checkup. How you beefing? You ain't never had you a life insurance or a checkup. Get your self respect up. Been drowning in bullshit from the neck down to the neck up, and still found a way to be next up. Like what, 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 what? This the new subculture in rap. It's called being real no matter what's going on in the trap and being unapologetically black. These are facts. Deleting my ways app, using only God for the maps. More facts. Meanwhile, the gatekeepers in rap only getting more lax. Fuck. We can learn from Mufasa. Niggas need to move faster. But they sons a new chapter. Open up the Black Panther and our blood. I'm more Malcolm than Martin. I'm sorry. Nat Turner and a Garvey. It's a war in our own backyard. So I ain't going to the army. Chains all around my feet. Put them back around my neck. Work until I can't sleep. Money just worth my stress. I bet you knew that. No. Hey. I bet you knew that. Hey. Can't catch this wave. Can't catch this wave. Now with your do rag on. One of these days I'm gonna be. Way far away, so low key. And I don't give a damn what your mouth say. Your fuck niggas still don't know me. And I don't wanna hear about your bread till you reach another night, get shot by the police. Can't catch this wave, can't catch this wave. Nah, can't catch this wave, can't catch this wave. This part right here is where tip verse will usually be. Shout out to the king of the South himself. It's crazy because I always feel like I really manifested this. I always said that there was an artist that I could link with coming out of the South. Ain't no bigger artist than Tip, man. It was blessed to be able to meet him and to sit down with him. In the first meeting, I was like, man, you owe a nigga like me to the game, man, because I feel like my, my word, my truth need to get out there. I need to help a lot of people. And uh, I think it kind of hit him in that moment. But you fast forward to today, we've merged. He's been on my album. I've been on his album. We've been on a 36 city tour together. And I'm from Alabama, I'm from Huntsville, Alabama, born in Albany, Huntsville, Alabama, like the unlikeliest character. So I really, I really feel like, you know, that's just God and that's the power of manifestation for sure, man. So this is where his verse would have been, but I had to let y'all know that for, for sure. Catch this way, the video's out too. Took them chains off around my feet, put them back around my neck. Working till I can't sleep no more with that money, just worth my stress. I bet you knew that though. Hey, I bet you knew that, yeah. Can't catch this wave, can't catch this wave, not with yo. Hey, one of these days I'm gonna be way far away, so low key. And I don't give a damn what your mouth say. You fuck niggas still don't know me. And I don't wanna hear about your bread till you're rich enough to not get shot by the police. Can't catch this wave, can't catch this wave. Nah. Shout out my brother Halftime Slim on the production. Shout out to the 85 band. My boy J.O. Win on the bass. You already know what time it is. Cut on the drums, cut, and clacks over there on the keys, doing what he does. You already know, it's no longer what it was. Yeah, chains all around my feet, put them back around my neck. Working till I can't sleep no more with that money, just worth my stress. I bet you knew that, though. Hey, I bet you knew that, listen. Can't catch this wave, can't catch this wave, not with your do-rag on. Oh, one of these days I'm gon' be way far away, so low-key. And I don't give a damn what your mouth say. You fuck niggas still don't know me. And I don't wanna hear about your bread till you're rich enough to not get shot by the police. Can't catch this wave, can't catch this wave. Yeah. Ladies and gentlemen, are you tired of not being fly as you can be? Are you tired of not looking the best that you mm -hmm. can look? Are you tired of walking around and people not asking you where you got that? Well, you need to change where you got that and come get some of what we got. And that's the 85 South Show of Pearl at 85apearlcompany.com. That's where you go to get all this fly shit we got on right here. Look, pull the pants out, man. You pull the pants out. Look, 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 look. Don't he look like he could go on the first day of school? Ain't even no school. Lady, <coughs> print friendly. Yeah, whatever he just said. I ain't with all that shit, but I am with the selling of the merchandise. So make sure you go to 85apearlcompany.com to get you some of this fresh gear. Like my man E-Man here. We ain't got the hair wraps yet, but we gonna get them. 
There's <laughs> nothing we can't do here at the sure. Eight Lives, and there's nobody that we can't have. There's nobody that we can't have. If here it's not a, if, if it's a gospel group that wants to come past and bless us with them gospel titties, with them gospel, t <laughs> them gospel titties, Baptist church breasts, gospel sanctified titties, sanctified nipples, sanctified nipples, yes, sir. Oh, nobody speak on all the fine women that be going to church. Yes, they do. The Lord has sent them there, my brother. Show me a woman who loves God. And I'm going to show you a woman who need $40. I believe you, my brother. Keep it going. Keep it going, my brother. You see, it ain't nothing to it. Yes, indeed. Uh, but to do it. And what is it that you got to do, Pastor? I said there's nothing to it. What is it that you got to do? Uh, but to do it. Tell them what you got to do, Pastor, because they're at home and they don't know. It could be anything. It's up to you what your it is. Yes, sir. I believe it was a great man who once said, I'm the shit, and if I ain't, y'all let me thank what I think. Exactly. Because can't nobody stop you from thinking what you're thinking but the Lord. Only you and the Lord can again. stop you from thinking what you're thinking. The only person that can stop you from thinking the things that you need to think when you need to think of is the man above, the Lord. I'm going to say it again. One my brother time. said, I'm the shit. And if I ain't, y'all let me think what I think. Now see if a man think it. What does it do, brother? He can be. Yes, indeed. I said, so as a man thinking. Yes, sir. He can be it. Yes, sir. You got to believe it first. Don't stop, Pastor. If you can believe it. Keep going, Pastor. You can achieve it. Yes, you can. I said, if you can believe it. Yes, you can. The man can achieve it. Yes, you can. Now, if you can believe it. Say it one more time, Pastor. You can conceive it. Yes, indeed. If I can see it. Yes. And then I can be it. Yes, you can. If I can feel it. Yes, you can. And then I can be it. Yes, you will. There's nothing to it. Nothing at all. But to do it. Yes, you got to. Because I believe. You believe. I can fly. Yes, you do. But if I'm the shit. Yes. And if I ain't. Yes. And uh, y'all in the room, let me think what I think. Yes, indeed. Pastor, I tell you, Pastor. If you didn't feel that in your spirit, then your spirit must have left your body. Because there is nothing that anybody can take from you but the man upstairs. So if you think you are the shit, then be the shit in your own mind. Because your mind is ordained by the Lord above. And my pastor has just laid it down. No better than it can ever be laid down in the name, in the mighty name. You ain't shit in the mighty name. You ain't shit in the mighty name. You ain't shit in the mighty name. you to be. Uh, but I'm just as through with you <laughs> as God is with me. And he ain't through with you. He ain't even got started on you yet, brother. <laughs> don't, don't get me started talking about God. Uh, yes, indeed. Because there's so much <laughs> we'll to We'll say. be here for a minute. Uh, we ain't got nowhere to go. We ain't got nowhere to go. We ain't got nowhere to be. Because when I talk about my God. What does your God say to you, brother? Uh, the one I serve. What do you do? <laughs> Y'all out here thinking God pity. You think
think God is petty. I don't think he is. I think he's worthy. Somebody, somebody told me, they say, you know, you can't, you can't do it like that because God, God is a jealous God. I said, jealous of what? Of who? Jealous of what? Of who? Who can be in the name and in the presence of the Lord and feel like they are in, in equality in any way, shape, or form? You think you competition with God? Uh, I don't know, but I know I would never try. That's what they think. What Ain't they? no competition. Ain't none. Ain't no jealousy. You lose. Jealous of what? You lose. In the name, in the mighty name. I don't even know what made them think they was competition to God. Who could think that? God is undefeated, never lost, every sport, boxing, The good brother Jay-Z said, the only thing that you leaving out, you're a candle in the sun. That, that shit don't, don't even, even out. out. Exactly, my brother. And he also said, what you eat don't make me shit. And what you eat will never make God do anything that he doesn't want to do. Because the food that you ate, the food in your stomach was provided to you. See, that's what's wrong with it. Man, get a few dollars. Uh-huh. And forget about God. Uh, how you forget about God? Look at the dollar in your pocket and say, in who we trust, not you. In God we trust. That's what it says. Not saying. in you. Not in you. We ain't never trusted in you. You can't even get no way on time. Whoa, you got some nerve. You got some nerve. Play it with the name. You thought you came here for something else. You ain't know God was going to find you right here watching this shit. Exactly, my brother. It's not a game. We are doing this, and it's ordained. We love everything, but nothing more, and nothing will ever be more than the Lord. Come on now. <laughs> everything I have. Everything you ever will have. Everything I thought I was. Everything you ever had. Everything I wanted to be. Everything you thought you would be. God has blessed me. Come on now. God has blessed me. With everything. God has blessed me. Gave me more than I ever will need. God has blessed me. Way more than I ever wanted. Oh, he has blessed me. He saw me when I wasn't nothing. God, he has blessed me. He put something in me that made me feel like I was something. God has blessed me. When did nobody love me? God has blessed me. You loved me, God. Oh, he has blessed me. When everybody turned their back. Oh, he has blessed me. You turned me around. Bless me. What I'm gonna have without you? Most of this is yours. Oh, has blessed me. If I don't get nothing else, I done had everything. He's blessed me. He's blessed me. He's blessed me. He's blessed me. He's blessed me with his glory. Come on now. He's blessed me. He's blessed me. Talk to him and tell him what he did for you. He's blessed me in the noontime and in the evening. You know what I did when I woke up this morning? Tell him what you did. I in looked the up name at God and I said, Thank you, Lord. Lord. You got me this far. I Tell get us the rest of the, the way. Of the Lord. I hit him on his phone. I said, God, I don't want Tell nothing. Tell him what you did in the name. I just want to say Lord. thank you. Oh, tell him Is what you okay did. Is that okay for me to just say thank you for what you did so far? Tell him what you did. I know the you ain't even nowhere close Lord. to being done with me, but thank you. Tell him what you did in the name of the Lord. I walked outside and I tell looked around and I said, in the name of the Lord. Come on now. Tell him what you did in his name of the Lord. Of the Lord. Come on. Of the Lord. For everybody who don't know how good he is. There is no power greater than the love of the Lord. 
of the Lord, oh, of the Lord. Oh, but don't forget, Carlos, he blessed me. Come on now. God has blessed me. Oh, he's blessed me. And he's blessing you because he's a blessing. Everybody out there who needs a blessing, raise your hands up high and sing with me. Now look here, we're not going to ask for no money. God but if you got some money in your pocket, take it out of your pocket and put me. it in your other pocket. Everybody in the house, raise your hand and sing with me and say, God. I said if you got money in your pocket. Everything. Take it out your pocket. To me. And put it in your other pocket. I don't think you feel me out there when I'm saying right now. Say, God is everything. What is it? To me. Don't be afraid to love them all. Come on Sing now. with me. Say, God, God is everything. He's everything, everything to me. Don't now. be afraid if you're out there in your house right now, sing it with me. Say, God is everything. He's everything to me. Oh, I'm not afraid to scream it at the mountaintops or in the valleys. I say, God is everything oh, to me. I'm not afraid to say it to you or him or her or them or they because God everything he's everything to me there is no one greater there is no power he is my savior god is everything he's everything to me to me yes to me all right y'all stop i'm about to give me another blunt Might yeah another blunt yeah that's how we do it it ain't a dry eye in here not one it ain't a dry eye here. That's how we do it, brother. I said it ain't a dry eye in here. It's a vibe. It's the 80 vibe in the name of the Lord. God bless you all. Lord.